Veterans Day is just around the corner, and while Hoosiers in the Armed Services become veterans, a new article from the Indiana Youth Institute talks about how their children become veterans in resiliency. Bill Stanzakevich from the Indiana Youth Institute joins us this morning to talk more about this topic. Thanks for being here with Good us morning, today. Les. Good morning. Yeah, this was really interesting to me. Some statistics that you had in your article: 44 percent mm -hmm. of active active duty military members are parents, and in Indiana, 18,000 children. And what's unique in Indiana is those children are scattered all over the 92 counties of Indiana, unlike military communities. When you mm -hmm. think about Fort Benning in Georgia sure. or the Naval Base in San Diego, those kids have a much more built-in support group of other families and everybody in the community knows about the military culture. Here in Indiana, as those kids are scattered around, the Military Family Research Institute at Purdue notes that uh, they're much more likely to feel lonely and isolated, which can increase their anxiety. Yeah. Uh, you know, they're acting out in school, behavior issues at home. Uh, so as their parent is wonderfully serving in the armed services, they can have some challenges back here on the home front. Sure, so what can we do to help? Well, Operation Military Kids is a program that has lots of formal activities that schools and youth agencies can utilize, like Military Kids in School Support, MKISS. Mm -hmm. It's an after-school club for military kids so they can uh, be together, have fun activities, talk about their shared experiences going on in the military. As for just everyday Hoosiers, the military kids say, don't set me apart. Don't bring me up in front of the classroom and, and uh -huh. call me out. But what we can do is, if we know a child has a parent in the military, pull them aside, ask them how they're doing. Uh, check in with their parent who is not deployed, is at home with them, uh, and just let them know that you're thinking about them. Be there to listen for them and be there as a neighbor. Very good advice. Something else that I thought was interesting is how being a child in a military family can actually be a positive for their development. Yeah, you know, there really are some positives. Uh, these kids tend to develop maturity faster. They learn mm -hmm. how to develop and handle independence faster. A lot of the military children tend to do better in school. So there can be a lot of positive attributes. And in surveys, the military children say, because they want their parent to be proud of them. When that parent returns home from serving our nation, they want their mom or dad to be proud of them for doing well. well very interesting article, and just the best advice is support our troops, support the, their families as well. And the other thing the kids say is when we support the troops, the kids feel that themselves. So we may disagree or disagree with a particular policy of our commander-in-chief, sure. but when we support the troops, as our nation wonderfully does now, the kids feel that in a positive way as well. well great. Bill, thanks again for being thanks, here Liz. this morning. We appreciate it.